Looking back four and a half years ago, I didn't expect to become a paraplegic or to end up going to a virtual high school, and I never would have expected to be sitting up here today in front of all of you making this speech. That's something with life, faith, or whatever you believe in, though. You don't get to pick and choose what it hands to you. I didn't get to decide I didn't get to decide to lose 70% of the feeling in my body. I didn't get to choose to have my, nar my nerves fry my arm at least twice a day. When a difficult chapter in your life comes, all you can do is take a course of action and keep going. I've had friends and even strangers come up to me and say, I don't know how you do it. I wouldn't be able to handle, I wouldn't be able to handle losing the ability to walk. I don't understand that concept. It's a simple choice. I could either lie in bed and waste away, or get to, or fight to get to where I am today. So I choose to go through an uphill battle, even after my second surgery, when my heart rate went up to 200 due to the surgeon nicking a nerve connected to my heart. To this day, I still have heart issues, but I fought and am still fighting whatever my health issue decided decide to throw at me. It's been a struggle, but with the help of Aaron Cunningham, who although when we first met it was a bit rocky, has stuck by me and stood by me while she has not made an advocate for myself. The principal and teachers who have supported me and changed their entire schedules to accommodate my needs. My friends and family who have been great moral support. And finally my father, who, although I know it's what parents do, was willing to put his entire life on hold for me. He's been my support since day one. With my incredible support system and determination, I keep going because I wanted to live my life to the fullest. So when someone tells me they wouldn't be able to go through this, I just don't understand because I personal, personally believe with the determination and the right support system, you can accomplish anything no matter what you are going through. Whether it be physical or emotional, you can still accomplish your dreams. Whether your goal is a high school diploma, a college education, or really anything you want, you can do it. Just be determined and take the, t take the steps to accomplish your dreams. You may not be able to choose what life gives you, but you can choose to work hard for your future.